Well, it's going to be 40 degrees next week, but right now not even half that 19 with the west wind making it feel even colder. We get a break from the snow today, but the cold sticking around for the start of your weekend. It's 20 in BG right now, a little bit less frigid in Fremont and Tiffin. However, very cold in Finley with a temperature of 16 degrees and that breeze. You will feel it, especially in Toledo there with a wind chill of seven. Finley Burr, three degrees is what it feels like. 13 is the feels like temperature in Napoleon. Single digit wind chills in Defiance. The weekend's going to start off cold, but I promise you'll warm up in that 10 day forecast coming up in about two minutes. Hourly temperature forecast puts us in the mid 20s for the afternoon. So if you have dinner plans for your Friday night, bundle up, wear the hat and gloves. It is going to be cold, especially with that wind tomorrow morning. Well, if you have a plan to maybe hit the metro parks early in the morning, if you can wait until the afternoon, I promise it'll get a little warmer. It's going to feel like it's in the single digits to start things off for your Saturday. However, the weekend is going to end on a bit of a milder note. Now, as I mentioned, a break from the snow. First alert Doppler nice and quiet after a busy day yesterday. The weather maker that brought us our snowfall yesterday has intensified out towards the east coast, bringing some heavy snow across some of the more populous cities on the Atlantic seaboard and then rain further to the south. That is history, though, and it's moving off to the sea. Our next weather system rolls in this weekend. Now we're going to start things off with sunshine. It is going to be a bit chilly to start off your weekend on Saturday. Sunday, though, brings our next chance for some rain and snow. We could see a bit of that wintry mix that we haven't seen in a while. A slushy mix possible into Monday morning. This is the weather system that I'm going to be timing out here. You'll notice both green showing rain and blue indicating the chance for a bit of snow. 8 o'clock PM on Sunday. This is after dark. This is likely you're already in the house um, kind of gearing up for the next work week. Looking at snowfall chances to the north, there is the chance for a bit of a wintry mix where temperatures are going to hover around freezing. I think this chance for mix is going to come in right around midnight, 11 o'clock PM, seeing some snow across the northern fringe of the viewing area. Could see some wet slushy mix further to the south. Hourly forecast kind of keeps us in that 32 degree mix territory for most of the night. Now there is the chance that this weather system leaves behind a bit of slushy accumulation for your Monday morning. This is at 8 o'clock AM and still seeing snow across a good portion of the viewing area. This is not going to be a big snowstorm by any means, but even a little slushy dusting is enough to cause some slowdowns for your Monday morning commute. So I wouldn't worry about this all weekend long, but it is something to keep in mind just as you're starting off next work week. Having that first alert weather app to stay updated this weekend certainly will come in handy. Weekend forecast worry free weather on Saturday, partly sunny skies mid 20s. We do warm up on Sunday, but whenever we are right around that freezing mark, there is the chance for a bit of that rain snow mix. You can see the wintry mix there for the second half of the weekend. All right, that warm up, I promised you 10 day forecast shows you 40s arriving by Tuesday, continuing into Wednesday, not just warm, but also dry weather continuing through next weekend. And overall it is staying warm. The weather kind of is a teeter totter this time of year, Amanda, but we're going from really cold to pretty nice, actually mild weather. I'll take the pretty nice works yeah. for me. John, thank you.